morning guys welcome back to our final day here in florida day 15 it's flown by it's gone so so quick the first week dragged a little bit dragged as in a good way not like uh, dragged it was terrible dragged it went nice and slow but the moment we, we kicked into second gear god it went fast but here we are final day we're going to spend um a good few hours here in epcot we've got guardians reservation we are group 35 i want to say 35 36 you know i'm gonna have a look at it now actually yeah See it's one of them at. Because last time we came to Epcot, it was raining. So they actually skipped quite a lot of groups because not a lot of people came in. Um, so we are group 30 something. 39. 39. So I was close enough. Yeah, it's group. now boarding groups 1 to 20 already. So we'll, I reckon it's going to be way early in 12 o'clock, which is fantastic. Yeah, me too. I think because so. once we've done that, we're going to go and get one of those boats at Magic Kingdom out on the. It's a uh, pontoon boat. I pontoon boat. Call it. Yeah. yeah. I think it's about $90 for up to 10 people. Yeah, we'll double check the price and um, let you know when we get there. But. I think um, we can get it from different hotels, but I think we're going to try from the Grand Floridian, I think. That's what we arranged yeah. with Viv and Karen anyway. Yeah, um, that'd be cool because we've never done that. It's going to be so it's gonna good. It's going to be that, so actually. good. Also, we want to hit Test Track today because it's, we still haven't done it this trip yeah. and Ben's never done it. Yeah. Um, so it's got to be like a priority. Yeah, that's our next. We're, we're gonna, I think we're going to do Frozen now. Yeah. And then we'll do Test Well, this is C yeah. now, it's make a car back half 10. See, see, see. So it's see. getting there. So we could probably do Frozen and then Test Track yeah, and then just I wait agree. around for this, maybe. Yeah, because we are in early half magic hour. So we're gonna we'll be able to sm smash it out easily, and those guys will end up coming in at nine o'clock. So I reckon we can do Frozen, and then once they come in, meet up with them. We're gonna head straight over to Test Track because that's one of the best rides in this park. So let's go. We've just got to Frozen now. It's currently posting at 25 minutes, so it might be a little bit faster than that. But the queue is coming out the door, so I think it's gonna be pretty accurate. But we don't mind. It's currently five to nine, so we've still got a bit of time before Nat and Ben actually come in, and then we're gonna head straight over to Test Track. <laughs> Just got off frozen now. It literally took us 15 minutes to get on the ride and off the ride. We've just checked the standby queue for test track and it's currently posted at an 80 minute, which seems pretty long for 20 past nine. So we might not get that done, but our guardians, what's our guardians saying? Yeah, our guardians is, is going to be up. Yeah, so it's going to be up really soon. Uh, so we might not grab test track. We could also try test track single rider. That could work, couldn't yeah, it? Yeah, but then we want to all go on together because we can oh, all sure get on it as a six. So I say we just wait till Guardians is done and just go on and just oh, wait yeah. for it. Okay. So I do want to do, do it. Could do the Mexico ride. Oh, the yeah. um, free cab. Yeah. Yeah, we could do that. Could we could tell them to come over here. She look, and she's got her ears on as well. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, we could do. We're just going to grab uh, Nat and Ben. There, they're currently at test track at the moment. That's how we found out uh, that it was an eighty minute. Which is a long time. I don't want to wait eight minutes. It's not on our last day as well. We don't want to be kind of wasting time. Not that much time anyway. Um, especially when we're only limited. But hey ho, we're making it later. Case is all packed now. Yeah, as as well. Managed with the legs are at the limit on everything. Yeah. 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 If this isn't full though, I've got a monster bag with it on. So we're just in the Mexican pavilion now. We just found These a bit cute. of merch. They're really nice. Oh wait, that's the back. Oh, turn it around. Hey. hey. That's a nice tea as well up there. These that have a price on it, I think. Not a price. No. No, no, they don't. Not today. That's a nice um cup. I do like two, that. Two things in different sides. Turn it around. Oh yeah. Little mini. Blue interior. It's going to be a good brew. Two towels. Oh, these. We, you actually spot these if you walked in. These are super pretty. These are $20. And how much you get? Three? Yeah, oh. two in a pack. I love that it says Epcot World Showcase on it as well. Me too. I love that. Colourful, yeah. Yeah, me too. I like. Got some decorations as well. Oh, Look at him. How much is that? Like that. 22. 23. That's quite expensive, right? Some really nice stuff here though, like look at this cushion here as well. Want that cushion up? That's very pretty. Super colourful. How much are we talking? Where's the price? 35. You know what? I'm not mad about that, I like it. 
That's a good uh, good cushion, that. Some lovely merch. This is really nice, isn't it? It's got Mickey's all over it. This is $65. Very similar to the one I actually got from Everest, which they also sell here for their $35 for yeah, that. Yeah. That's really nice. I like that one. Yeah, the other one was from Everest. Just from there. Feel the weight of that. Ones. Yeah. Feel the weight of that. Oh wow, that's that's heavy. That's a lot. That's lovely. How much is this? I don't know, it's got a 35 here, but I don't think it is. I think it might be because it's not Disney related. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's not got the it I feel like anything. it could be 35. Aha! Uh -huh. $35 for that! That's amazing! I would love to lounge around in this. Yeah. That's amazing. I found some of it is as well. These are 35. Hmm. I think I prefer the other ones though. I love these. I'm not sure I would ever get them back home. $400 for the castle, which is there. Steamboat Willie, two ninety. I pay that. I pay two ninety for that. Some of that ones. These also oh, very very small, but still three hundred dollars. Oh, I love them. I can imagine if you started getting attached to these, it would cost you a lot of money. Oh, you'd be. I'd be spending like crazy. How would you get them home? That's what. That's my concern. Is how would I get that home? Because I've actually bought one very similar to Jimmy Cricket here. And it was the 90th, I think it was, at, in Paris. And um, I can't remember what it was. It was, what was it celebrating? 90 something, either way. Uh, it's broke now anyway. It's very similar to that. Very, very similar to this. 90 years in Mickey Mouse? I think it's nine, I think it might have been 90 years, yeah, yeah. 90 years in Mickey Mouse, Yeah, very similar to this, like, like this, but with like a big 90, golden 90 in there. And uh, we've broke it now, unfortunately. I did take it back to Disneyland Paris, but they couldn't fix it for us, unfortunately, so. It's massive shame, but it is it is what it is, isn't it? Like, there's nothing else we could do about it. I was gutted at the time, I'm not gonna lie, but no, I'm just like, it is what it is. Maybe I buy a new one, I could get a new one, I could get Steamboat Willie. Best ride ever. Are you excited, Luce? Oh, yeah, they're uh, are they maracas. Oh. Bye bye. So Steve's actually gone meeting Snow White um, and I'm going to go in here, the Caramel Couche in the Germany Pavilion. I might get some popcorn for breakfast like I did last trip. Why not? I've never seen these before. Well there's original Blissful Bites. So this is a caramel one so it's got caramel inside it I think. Crunchy malt flavour. They've also got blueberry. And then they've also got, this sounds good, chocolate cookie ones. Crunchy chocolate cookie inside. Hmm. How much? Oh, these are $8.99. Hmm. They sound good. They've actually got reasons as well. I'm not sure if these were the ones Steve were looking at for last trip. But we've actually got them here. How much? $4.29 are they? There's a sign there saying 429, but not sure if it's them ones, but see if he picks them up. Like I said, not too sure if they were the ones he was looking for, but so yeah, I'm gonna pick these up for breakfast. These are the caramel popcorn with streaked waffle, salted pretzel pearls, and chocolate fa flavoured drizzle. These are the ones I had last time, they were so good. These are 999. Guys, the hunt continues! Oh, so they're not the ones that These are not the for. ones. These are the ones that I can get everywhere else. Um, uh, but I can get I'm them for sure. a hell of a lot cheaper in the UK. They're like a quid at home bargains or something. Mm -hmm. But again, I've only ever seen once milk chocolate regionals. Damn it! And no deal! The hunt continues! I will get them. You watch. Went for a caramel chocolate s'mores Werther's cookie. I've never tried the cookies before, but I've heard good things about them. So this was. Six dollars and thirty something. I'm gonna say. So let's give it a try. Mm. That's a good cookie. So have a little look close up of it. You're gonna like that. Wow. How much was that? About six dollars thirty. Mhm. Mm That's amazing. That's really really nice. It's uh, punchy. It's not soft. So I think you'll really like it. Oh. All oh, right. Yeah. I don't it really does like have soft where there's cookies. caramel on it though. So maybe try it. I'll try it. Yeah. Really nice. Really good. So good. Is it fun?
Just on the hunt for a little bit of breakfast for people. Although we've had cookies and stuff, it's not really real breakfast, technically. She's got, She's got a popcorn. I've had a cookie, but if I do see like a nice dirty ham and cheese croissant or something, you know I gotta get it. I also might pick up when we get to French France, because I think we're going to France. Um, I might get one of those brioche with ice creams. It's been a long time since I've had one. In fact, I've not had one since 2018. I wasn't blown away by them at the time, but I'm going I'm willing. I'm willing, oh, I'm gonna have to give it another try. which I got last time. It was 11 19 so it was a hell of a lot cheaper than my last breakfast I had here in the French Pavilion. I think it cost me about $43 last time. This cost me $11.19, so the water you can hear also is uh, we're right by the fountain. Views on views. Let's give it a try, shall we? So good. I think it's probably my favourite breakfast there. I've had the, yeah, that's the one I had last time, wasn't it? Yeah, I've had the croissant and that. Um, but I think, I think it just tastes a little bit better. Yeah, I think that's the best thing to get. Super light as well. I also noticed that ice cream shop's not open. I don't know what time it opens. Every time I pass it, it's shut. Alright, oh, maybe it's a bit later. I like midday, maybe. maybe. Like 11 or 12. Maybe, yeah. Because yeah, a lot of like, these stands you can see behind the there, they're not open either. No. So I reckon later on. Yeah. This, by the way, amazing. Just had breakfast. It was a beautiful and very cheap this time, which is rare for me because uh, I really want that brioche bun ice cream so I'm gonna wait it out and I've just had a cookie so there's a point where I've got to stop being greedy but I'm gonna go back and get that because I'm really looking forward to trying it again I hope it's good uh, but the plan now is we're gonna head back over to Guardians because we are the next boarding group it still does say uh, estimated wa waited time about 15 minutes so by the time we get that I reckon we would have been called we've convinced Chris Leanne and Luce to come and do this we think they're gonna like it I think Luce is definitely gonna like it Chris I'm not sure. It will. But we're all going on it. It's our last day, so we finally uh, bantered him into it, didn't we? Are we excited? Mm -hmm. She's not sure. <laughs> she'll love it. Listen, she loves Space Mountain and all the other stuff. Hagrid. She's going to love this. It's a great ride. <laughs>
literally as we got to the Guardians right now, we were just called. Are we ready, Luz? No. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to be sick. <laughs> Listen, I, I would never do this to you. You're going to love it. You're going to love it. Mm -hmm. I hope she loves it. So I'm hoping we get September Earth, Wind and Fire. It's the song that everybody says is one of the best, so pray for me. This time we got Disco Inferno. I'm not sure if we had it last time, I can't remember. But it was amazing. I survived, guys. You liked it, didn't you? Yeah. I said she'd like it. It was actually Leanne's favourite ride. Was that right? Even better than the Star Wars rides, and she's a big Star Wars fan. You know what? I think. See, I love Flight of Passage, that's always my favourite, but I think that could be my second favourite. Yes, yeah, good. Oh no, wait, Hagrid's. Oh no, but out of Disney, it's my second favourite. Amazing, isn't it? Yeah. It's amazing. It's really, really good. Space Mountain is nothing now compared to that. The only problem like, was, um, if you guys have been on it, there's a scene before, like a build-up before you oh actually yeah. get to the ride. That was completely cut off. Mm. Uh, I don't want to say what it is because I don't want to ruin it for you, but it's, 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 it's the start it. of it where, you know, Terry Crews is on the big screen and, and you get the story behind it. So we didn't quite get the... I had to basically um, let these guys know the story behind what was actually happening on the ride. I came off anyway. shaking. I'm still shaking. But, but I, I had my eyes open the whole way, guys. Even the backwards launch, open my eyes. I was silent. I didn't scream. I think I was just like taking it in. But Chris but did. Chris screamed. It was yeah. It was really, really, yeah. really good. So we just got the test track now. It's currently posted at a 70 minute. So do you guys want to do it or no? Yeah. Yo, Chris is dying already. One ride. Oh no. Is rough. No. Nope. Yeah, we'll definitely do it. <laughs> so worth it. So unfortunately, we didn't make test track again. It's gone down again. I think it's like the, the one's its fourth time this morning. It's gone down, and when we were queuing, we decided, you know, we're going to wait it out. Uh, but they did make an announcement and said they could not restart the ride. So yeah, it, um, it came back on, didn't it? As they said, yeah, like, it resumed. We've got it, we've resumed um, operation. Cars, but the wait time might be a bit longer than what it said when we first got in, and then mm. like. Five minutes later, they were like, yeah, it can't be yeah, restarted. Yeah, it can't be restarted. And we don't know when it's going to be back up. So, so everybody started to leave, unfortunately. So, I mean, we don't want to wait, let no. use our um, last day just waiting in queues, I guess, for someone yeah. to come on. So, it's I think, though, I think that means we're going to have to grab it next trip. So, Ben, we'll get it next trip. Never mind. Never mind. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and grab a violet lemonade yeah. because we missed out on the night blossom before we left animal kingdom for the last time so i said we definitely need the violet lemonade yeah, we'll grab do. that wait for nat because she obviously went uh, wasn't going to ride test track so she went and tried grabbing a cup from the boardwalk she's going to come back and meet us yeah. and then we're going to head over to the contemporary because we're going to get a boat um, outside magic kingdom yeah the pontoon but i think the i mentioned it earlier yeah. didn't we one of the clips yeah but vivian and Cameron are over there now so we'll go meet them and do the boat first is first violet lemonade <laughs> Oh, this is nice. Oh, I like that. That is incredible. Wow. Look at that piece of art. How, how much is that? But it's quite heavy. 
Well, I've never seen this um, Marvel stuff, but this is $100. Wow. That's good quality though, isn't it? It's got yeah. a nice uh, cushion as well. That's really nice too, there it is. What we're talking on price uh, for the uh, cushion. So this will set you back uh, $40. It's quite expensive, but I guess cushions will last you forever. It's like it's all marble in the shop. Is it? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I've never seen any of these before. Well, $45. Wow, is this Wakanda forever? Must be. They are super expensive. Yeah, little wings off that guy's ankle. Yeah, super expensive. Wow. That's not the first, yeah. Wow, look, check this out. So it seems in this store, um, it seems to be marble only. That's what it looks like. So for the metal shield with the carrying case, which by the way feels really good, $450 for that. That's amazing. I also like these, I showed these last time. These have got me 45, I think. Doesn't say a price. So nice. I would absolutely love that. How sick would Imagine that, that just on your wall. I'd walk around with it, me. I just walk, she would. walk around. That's all right. Of course, you would. This is from the Vaults collection. It's like memories, I think it is. Look how sick that is. Look at that. You've also got um, Fantasmic. We saw that, didn't Fantasia. we? In the, animal, the shopping animal kingdom. Well, look at the back. Remember, we saw that. Yeah, that's cool, actually. So nice. The price of that is. 55, that's really good. That's nice. Do you not remember? We saw it in Animal Kingdom when they had that t-shirt, didn't they, Fantasia? Oh, I, I, you know, honestly, I can't remember. We've seen that many things. It's yeah. Too hard to remember. Um, I don't know what this is. Mm, this is not the best at all. Look at that. Wow. Is that's that from, a, like... A lot. The, yeah, this is kind of like a... Like Main Street Electrical Different Parade. Pictures of like in the like past. Pictures, yeah. yeah, in the past. This is going to be this is quite expensive, I think. Oh, seventy dollars. That's not bad. You should get yourself some gym leggings, Esty. These are just your colour. These. Yeah. I think you look great in them. This is a bit me. Oswald shit. I really like that. So do I. And it feels super light, like really, it'd be perfect for Florida weather. Uh, this will set you back $60. Very nice. This is my favourite. This is my favourite piece. How nice is that? I've never seen this before, by the way. Yeah, I like that. I this like that. will set you back. Uh, I like right. the neck bit of it as well. I sort of like that. 60. Buy it. Is this females? This Must is extra be. large. Turn around. <laughs> is it? Yeah, that's not right. That. A few moments later. The last one of the trip. Oh, that makes me sound a bit more. Mm. It's honestly. The best $4.50 you'll spend. 100%. The best. Well, the cream cheese pretzel is also a good yeah. you know, way to use your money. But. This is a good clock. Yeah, close call. Mm. So close to second slash first. Yeah, it's, we love a night blossom as well, don't we? But mm. we didn't get time to have that, so no. I'm so glad we've. I forgot about it until we came this morning. I was like, oh, violet lemonade, we have to get one. I'm talking about the flower though, but Leanne might eat that. <laughs> she ate my last one.
so we've just got to the boat nuke it's called here it's basically just at the back of the contemporary so if you get on the monorail and you want to find your way down to the boat nuke you can jump in the elevator and go to Level, level four. four and then you get an escalator where chef mickey's is mm -hmm. get an escalator down it's to the turn left, left. Chef, chef mickey's turn left and come out and yeah. it's just here like you can't miss it there's signs everywhere as well so it's yeah easy. so for 30 minutes it's 45 dollars and for an hour it will cost you 90 dollars yeah. and basically you don't you pay at the end so you'll go out and the time you come back you'll pay for the time that you've had yeah and the guy will just tell us the departure time and then yeah. he works it out for when we come back but we're going to try and do the half an hour yeah. one and that's for 10 people as well i think it is isn't it uh, 10 people yeah. in the boat I think. Uh, yeah, 10 max on the boat. 10 max on the boat. But obviously we've got eight, so we're going to do the $45 divided by the eight of us, so yeah, it's yeah. nothing, is it? Just make sure if you are wanting to drive, bring your ID as well. Uh, if yeah. two people want to drive, don't worry, they only need one, uh, the chap said. Uh, but yeah. just bring your ID if you can. Uh, it makes everything a lot easier for yourself. Yeah, I think it's just to show that you're over, over 18. 18, basically. Yeah, basically, yeah, yeah. To, um, to be able to do it. But, but there's plenty of yeah, boats out. Plenty now, yeah. I think when Vivian and Karen were here before, there was only one left. So we were like, oh my god, please still yeah. be there. But there's loads now, there's like five or but six. You know what? So. We've seen one pass by and they're quite fast. So mm -hmm. it's going to be fun. I'm so, I'm we so have, excited for this. We've never ever done this. Um, I saw a vlog, Adam Hatton did it, and we said them we Someone the else did it as well, I think I saw in a vlog. Or it might have been on Instagram, someone did yeah. it, and I thought, you know what? Put that on the list i want to do it yeah it looks sick it looks sick so we'll just sign a bit of paperwork because everybody has to yeah. sign we're gonna jump on the boat and head out and hopefully have the best time i'm so excited so excited so this is our boat look how good this is oh wow thank you oh, hey yo hey yo there's our captain captain willie co-captain wow. co right here this is such a lovely boat. Is it? This is amazing. A few moments later. Okay, so we're switching boats because this one won't start. Okay, second boat. Let's hope this one works. Oh! That is hot. That is hot. I would watch her wings. Pink is no egg zone, so you have to go on idle speed. That's up to this arrow yeah. right here. When you go to that arrow, you'll feel quick. You'll hear it. That's how you know you're going idle speed. Red is restricted. I will say the islands try to keep two to three boat lengths away from there because your engine can get caught in the sea and then you have to call lake patrol, which is yeah, we don't want that. Um, do be careful out there. We do have the ferry boats. Please do give them the right of way since they're bigger than you. They can't stop for you. But if at any point you ever feel uncomfortable that you're kind of in the way of a ferry boat, feel free to back up. Um, if at any point you guys ever feel uncomfortable, excuse me. There is life jackets right here and all over the boat. And water. It's crocs in there. It's alligators. Just one. That's more than enough for me. Just one. Find him. If the boat ever catches on fire, we don't see. We've got snacks and everything. <laughs> hey, oh, we have snacks. Hey, oh, we have some snacks going on here. Nikki rice cake. Oh, nice. There is a fire extinguisher right here. I thought you wanted to put us out with snacks then. <laughs> a floating device right here. Smash it. Brilliant. Full speed. Full speed. Full speed. <laughs> so we've been going in the wrong direction. We're going the right direction now. We're going to head to Magic Kingdom. Who do we blame, Lucy? Everybody left. Yeah. <laughs> You're mean. I went on Guardians, alright. Woohoo! <laughs> Will it draw you in? What's the moment? Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Coconut, what's the lesson? What is the takeaway? Don't mess with my way, he's on a microwave.
That, that was, was amazing. Yeah. I loved every minute of that. Engines and off, captain's done. You set that up. Oh, that really yeah. Want a picture? Yeah, boy. Let's do this. Bye, Chris. Bye. 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 Love this shit. Bye. Love you. Bye. So we've just got off the boat now. Uh, we thought we'd been out an hour. It turns out we'd only been out 50, and they actually charge you by the minute. So yeah. for the 50 minutes, it cost us $80, I think it was, which was $10 each. $10 each. And we both got free captain hats. Sailor Stee. Whoosh. <laughs> that to me was money well spent. That's one I of the best things I've done. Best ten dollars spent, like. And I'm, oh, we said I think this. My, sorry, my, my favorite thing was the airboat ride, and then this is like a yeah. close second. Because the thing is, right? So good. Everybody knows, you know, Disney. Anything Disney related is really expensive. But the fact that we all got to go on the boat for an hour, we got free hats. I say free hats, you know, we did technically pay for it, but for $10 each. I even each. think like $80, if it was only two of you and you paid $40 for that, I even still I still great. think that's even worth it. But like, if that's you really have, good still. If you've got 10 people, it'll be even cheaper. It'll be even cheaper. Even cheaper, eight, eight of us, yeah. yeah. Insane. Oh, insane. The views as well, guys. Yeah. And the people, they had like, what do you call them lifeguards? I don't know what they call um, them. No. They're on these boats, like that security kind of thing. Yeah. They were like telling us to stop, and like they were really, really nice, telling us where Coast the best guards. photo spots. Yeah, let's say Coast Guards, hmm. telling us where the best photo spots were. Like it was amazing. Really, really good. It was amazing. We got some really good pics. Yeah. We connected our phone as well and started blasting oh, it happily yeah. ever after, and it was just mega. Who needs a DJ when you've got us? So good, <laughs> so good. Oh, it was amazing. Yes, yeah, so we're Absolutely not sure. That. We're not sure the plan now. Now we do no, only no, have. No, we're doing say two and a half hours left before yeah, it's we 3 p.m now and we're getting picked up at five past six yeah from our hotel so we're so not sure a few hours still left yeah, to do something i say we go to some sort of park though yeah get on like a few a few I, more rides i don't think viv and kaz can do it though no they but, can't go to one yeah. but it's a shame it's a shame but at least we did this this with them yeah exactly. which was, it was, it was lovely amazing. to see them again it was on amazing. our last day so sad that we did it on our last day because that would have been amazing to spend the evening watching the fireworks on there but i mean never say never we could be back again yeah at christmas i was going to say that fireworks one is like next amazing. on the bucket list because that yeah. would be so so good yeah so we've come up with a plan we're going back 
to Animal Kingdom. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we need the night blossom. We do. We guys. need burger we pots. <laughs> yeah, I need ch cheeseburger pots. Yeah, yeah, and we need to pick up a pin that I've lost. Yes. So, so we may as well go. We may as well for the last and couple I of think hours. Dinosaur, when I just checked them, was showing 20 minutes. So yeah, might have to have a cheeky little dino. And ride. of course, I'm keeping my hat on because <laughs> it'd be rude not to. My captain. I think you've got to keep it on all day. Mm. Change of plan. <laughs> the bus never turned up, um, and we waited. 30 minutes then the time changed again for another 15 minutes so we decided you know what we're next door to magic kingdom um we don't Makes have sense. much left much time left so we don't want to be wasting it is what's this oh it's typhoon lagoon no, that boss we don't want to be wasting that what what time is it now so it's half three, three. so we have two hours before we yeah. need to be getting back to the hotel yeah um we didn't want to waste that time so we're just going to head over to magic kingdom get Yay. cream cheese pretzel i want to sit in the hub i'm getting a bit hungry now so i wouldn't mind oh, i need some sort of food real food proper food i say yeah. real food i mean theme park food but food instead of sweet there's going to be room yeah. for something sweet after the food um yeah, we'll see if there's any rides we can get on what the wait times are and stuff when we get in there yeah I'd like to do a ride at least. But it's just typical. Like I said, we've been already waiting oh. half an hour and the bus is saying another 15 minutes and if it doesn't turn up, we've wasted 45 minutes. Yeah, we just kept being delayed. Yeah. 15 minutes before. Yeah. Don't want to just be sat in this bus stop and our last day to do we? No, exactly. So. I agree. I agree. Yeah. So yeah. let's go to Magic So Magic Kingdom, Kingdom it is. I mean, I'm not disappointed. I mean, like, I'm not. I'm, not <laughs> I'm here for it. it. Like, yeah. I love Magic Kingdom. I love Magic Kingdom. Um, our favourite, isn't it? Yeah. So we decided what we're going to do, the first thing in this park is we're going to go on the Disney Railroad because we haven't done that this trip and uh, I actually didn't realise you could do it. So we said obviously, wow, so we got a lot of free time to kind of just enjoy the park, we're going to hit the railroad. <laughs> Just got off the Disney Railroad now. It took about 30 minutes in total to get around, which is super peaceful. It's so nice to do it. But we've come off now, it's half four. So we're just about to grab some food. And we're looking for some form of mac and cheese that we think we know where we're gonna get it from. I'm not 100 sure what it's called, so once I get to it, I'll show you what it's called. Friar's Nook. Friar's Nook, that's where we're gonna go. I we had some we had some food last time and it was amazing. So we're gonna go to yeah, Friar's Nook. Mac and cheese, tops, tater tops. tops. Yeah. I really fancy them. Yeah, and then I want to grab maybe one final American, traditional American Sunday from the ice cream parlor here on Main Street. Um, I just want something saltier first, because I'm getting a little bit hungry. 
starving. I'm starving now. now. I've only had that um, popcorn. Yeah. And a few crisps and. And I've had that, like not proper food. Cookies and a uh, croque monsieur. Oh yeah, you had the toasted, didn't you? Yeah. So. But that was about six hours ago, guys. <laughs> like that's a long time I've gone without eating in a Disney park. So. Know, what is wrong with us? We're just trying to. Trying to get everything in as much as possible. Yeah, I so, agree. Let's go grab some food. Okay, so I went for a kids' meal. So we got the kids mac and cheese. We did ask if they did an adult portion of it. They said no, but to be fair, it's quite a good, quite a good size cup that. So I got kids mac and cheese, and it comes with two sides. You either pick an orange, or they call them cuties, don't they? Or apple slices. So I went for two lots of apple slices, and then I got a minute made lemonade, and then Steve got bacon mac and cheese tots without the spring onion. Normally comes with spring onion, and you got a, a, was it a coke? I got coke. He's still wearing his hat, guys, going strong. And this came to how much? $24. $24. And it's from the Friars Nook, which I think we mentioned. So, I'm not going to lie. I saw the hot dog when I came out, so I'm kind of food envy. Got food envy here, because it looked amazing. But you know what? I really like mac and cheese, so... Sorry about the noise, guys. Everyone's shouting. Mm. Very noisy in this area. It's a vibe, this area, like. Mm. Everyone's in such high spirits. It's, I absolutely love it. Such a nice place to sit so as well. What we're saying? It's wonderful. Yeah. So good. So good. Oh, I really needed that. So the plan is we've got 20 minutes left. So I'm going to see how busy the ice cream parlor is, and hopefully I can get an all-American traditional Sunday. I've got $12 left on my Revolut, so I should have. I mean, of course I'll have enough for it. It's just whether it's busy or not. Because like I said, we do have 20 minutes left before we need to head out of the park. Unfortunately. Hey, so Leanne, we come walk through the castle. Yeah. They, by the way, they closed the castle for a show, but they've opened it back up now, so we're going to have a quick walk through. Um, and then Lucy wants a picture with the castle before we leave. And then, unfortunately, it's the end of Magic Kingdom again, which is sad. But let's get this ice cream. Isn't it funny? So we got two of the traditional all-American sundaes. Yep. I went for chocolate and strawberry, and Lucy went for mint, chocolate chip, and cookies and cream. Yep, so I'll that. take that. They, they're gonna be amazing, aren't they, let's be honest. We've had them before, didn't we, but yeah. I, don't, I think I had vanilla and cookies and cream last time, so I went for the mint one this time. So good. I'm gonna miss this. I know, These were, um, I like hot fudge, uh, hot fudge now, so I'm gonna miss it on everything now. $15 for the two of them. But yeah. It's amazing. It's amazing. Yeah, because they're a really good size. Really this. Good. The final snack of this trip. Yeah. Unfortunately. I just said that, yeah. Then it's back on my diet. Yeah, so once we've eaten this, we're going to head out and get the bus back to Pop Century. Yeah. Pick our bags up. So it's checkout time. Yeah, I have to say bye to the castle. And just like guys, we are at the airport. Mia's was super smooth all the way. And guess what just happened? I just met the big show from WWE. If any of you guys watches WWE, I just met the big show. She has no idea. Did you ask him to subscribe? No, I didn't. Oh, <laughs> but I got a picture, I get loose to drop a picture and I was meeting the big show. It was massive, but that like, Ben really said, I just, just looked at him and thought, I know you. And then we asked him like, are you Paul White? And he was like, yeah, yeah. And we was all looking at that. No way, that's, that's it. We used to, I used to play him on PlayStation 1 and 2 and that like, that's insane. Anyway, got he starstruck. Got starstruck for a minute. He was massive, seven foot one or whatever he is. Massive. So yeah, we just let a big show. <laughs> but we're we, so out of focus. We're so out of now. focus now. Um, the vlog sick of hearing you go on about big show, the big show or whatever it's called. Yeah, but we are in the uh, terminal now. We've just got to terminal A. a. 
So okay. anyway, we have checked in, we bought the bag. We put an extra bag on there, it cost us $81, so yep. not too bad. Not, not too bad. bad. Yeah. Our cases, mine is bang on 23, guys, yep. look at that. Yeah, we weren't over at all, so no. that's fantastic. And our other ones were like way, way less, weren't it? A little bit less. Yeah, little but less. mine were 23, like yeah. literally bang on. Everyone else's were fine as well. Yeah. So yeah, we're just going to head in the uh, Disney store, the Universal store, just have a quick look around because once you go through security, which I'm sure most people know, there's nothing really on the other side like these shops. It's all duty free in that. So we're going to check these out, kind of um, take yeah. it all in while we're here. But it's so nice to be back at this 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 airport, this better terminal. Than terminal C. Yeah, yeah, much better this one. Um, yeah. For now, by the way, for now, while Terminal C is not quite ready this is nice to be back here yeah definitely and the security doesn't look that bad even oh, to get through so we can do some shopping here let's probably. have a look around then i should be the big show oh, i'm gonna miss using my magic band until next time oswald until next time this is really nice i like the colors how much i like this theme 28. Oh, not bad. I do like it. I love this. We just said this. We love the theme here. The colours are so nice. Yeah, because we've got a, like hoodies, t-shirts and stuff in this like theme and I really like that. I do. I like the different colour, the ombre type of colour mm -hmm. as well, aren't they? Very nice. Mm. We are also still on the hunt for the graham cookies. We've been unsuccessful this trip. Yeah, they're not here either. I just don't think they make them anymore. It was weird because I don't know if I mentioned it in the confectionery store. Was it last night? Yeah. They had them in the window, so I was like, oh my god, have they got them back in stock? No. no. They better not have discontinued them. <laughs> Damn it, Disney. $55. That's really nice, isn't it? I also really like this cap. Oh, I've never seen that before. Yeah, it's like Mickey through the years, I'm going to say, or... We have a little close-up. Oh, Steamboat's just there, you see him. Oh, it's got so much Mickey on it. Yeah. How and much? This is... Let me just check for you. Uh, there's not a price on it. There's and yeah, he is still wearing his hat in the airport. He's not it off yet. Yeah. Captain's Day. No, it's Sailor's Day. Big show! We'll have a look in here, why not? Be rude not to. Hey, that wasn't as loud as you know, would it? We'll allow that. No, we're in a very, very quiet airport. <laughs> yeah, they, won't, they won't be letting you on the plane. No, they say, get out. These are amazing. They'll be like, he belongs in Universal. Look at these. You must be able to buy them because they've got the... Um, oh, you definitely can. Yeah, like definitely can. Packaging still on them. Look at that. So obviously, they've got one for each of the houses. I need to find out how much these cost because these are amazing. Um, $195. Do you know what? I'd pay that. Because it's hand luggage, so it won't get damaged as much. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're actually, yeah. I'd pay that. Obviously, we'd get the slipper in one because. Because it'd be rude not to. That is what house we were both in. Yeah. So we just come to the food court. Now, this is probably the first time we've ever actually come to this. So we've got obviously carve outs. I actually had this in New York. This was one of my favourite places to go. Late the late evenings we spent in uh, Times Square. It was just on the side. You've obviously got Mole South uh, West Grill. That's amazing. We have that at Universal. McDonald's. You can't go wrong with a McDonald's. Panda Express as well. Yep. Oh sorry, it's just around here, Panda Express. It's just there. Then you've got obviously Cinnabon, Chipotle, you've got Auntie Anne's. Sparrow, that's good as well. Yeah, there's a lot of, there's a lot of um, nice places to choose from. So I think I'm gonna get some moles. Uh, I didn't get moles this trip because the queue is always crazy, crazy long and it takes a while in City Walk. So I think while we're here, for the last uh, meal of the trip, I'm thinking I might get some chicken and cheese quesadillas. I do love me some quesadillas. I think these guys are going to go for Mackie's as well. Not sure about Luce, she hasn't quite decided yet, but I'm sure I'll let you know. So we both decided to go to Moe's Southwest Grill. Yeah. And uh, I did originally ask for a quesadilla, but they don't do them apparently anymore at this specific one. No, there was only burritos, tacos, or like the bowls and salads yeah. on the menu. So you made I, it a burrito, right? Yeah, I went for a plain Jane chicken, rice, cheese, salad. Oh, cream. you went for rice? Put some rice in it. Nice, treat yeah, yourself. Yeah. So, and they're massive try. as well still aren't they? Look yeah. the size of them. And Lucy went for? I went for rice, black beans, chicken, cheese and pico de gallo. Mm. I think that's better than the quesadilla. Mm. I did say. Because that's what I went for quesadilla the fish trip and the next trip I got the burrito and I always prefer the burrito. That's lovely. Because they filmed like to the brim like they're literally like so stuffed with toppings, so, aren't they? If you call them toppings. For this, for this drink, it's thirty dollars. Thirty-two dollars. We're gonna get a Mackey's Coke, but the queue is 
ended up being really long, so I was like, we'll just get a minute made. So whilst Lucy and the rest of the gang are eating up, I've just seen a sweet shop. Be rude not to come in, wouldn't it? God, I remember these. Do you remember these? The little burgers, they're obviously a lot bigger than that, last time I remember. They came in like, they were about this big, I think. Oh, I do love a jelly bean. So I actually had, um, I think it was these ones last trip it could have been. I'm not going to lie, I weren't a huge fan. Those are amazing. Jordan Almond's pop butter popcorn. Bet these are unbelievable. <gasps> Cold stone. If anyone going to Universal, the City Walk, especially, obviously, go to Cold Stone. I promise you, you won't regret it. Still no milk chocolate. The hunt continues. I don't think I'll ever find the milk chocolate ones. I just don't think I will. Damn it! This. This is just wrong. Nope. So I was going to pick up a pink lemonade for Lucy. She said, buy me a surprise. But apparently they've got them on the other side through security. So saves are throwing it away. I'll wait till we get through. We found a huge, giant gummy snake. This is $20. Ooh, you'll have no teeth left after that. They even do a teddy bear and a gummy frog. So this is $6. That's, to be fair, that's not bad. $6 for that. 20 for the bear, not sure that's worth Full it. English breakfast. For $20 as well. That's pretty decent value actually. You get quite a lot for that. And they've got loads of pick and mix as well here. So we just made it through security now. We've just come into Stella News now because Lucy has just seen loads of pink lemonade, strawberry lemonade, whatever you want to call it. Minute made. No, we can't get this at home, so she's obsessed with it. She just said she's gonna buy loads. I think I might get some as well. Last time we came back with about eight bottles, I think. I know we've already got four liters in our suitcase, but we want to take a little bit more because we're not coming out here for a good few months, unfortunately. So let's head on in. What do you have, young lady? <laughs> Show us what you have right now. <laughs> do you think three is like enough or should I get more? Well, I'm going to get some too. Yeah. Maybe you should get three and I get three. Yeah, perfect plan. Because we've already got big ones, haven't we? We've got yeah. one. Four we've litres. got two big of these, haven't we? Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah, buddy. So we decided to get seven bottles. I've spent all my money now. Zero dollars. All gone. Left. Yeah, I was about, I I was about 40 cents shy, but she let me off. I didn't realise, I'm not going to lie. I was like, oh, sorry, but she was like, no, no, it's fine, it's fine. So that's kind of a, uh, but we've got as many as we possibly can now. We've got about, I'd say like seven or eight litres. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty excessive, isn't it? No. Yeah, we love it. So we've just found the anti answer just before we get called to our gate and grab, hopefully, a frozen lemonade. I'm not sure if they do frozen, but they definitely do normal strawberry lemonade. Yeah, um, I can see it, yeah. But I would much prefer a frozen because it is way better. So good news. We got frozen lemonade. It was just under twelve dollars for these two large ones. Yeah, eleven dollars something. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god. I'm gonna miss it so much. Mwah. I love it. I might just um, steal the machine. Yeah. <laughs> I tell work, you what, right? we timed it right because everything is shutting now. I forget how late it is. Yeah, that's still a place that we've just bought yeah. them um, bottles of made lemonade. It's shut now. Yeah. Time that right. Time that well, yeah. Mm. And yeah, it is late. And I keep looking, guys. We've not got my watch on. <laughs> I'm being that person. I'm keep going. Oh. Right. So the plan. We're gonna go find the other guys. Sit at the gate, yeah. Uh, yeah, they were at Starbucks last. They've just found a uh, we've been there series mug. We've been looking for it all trip for nap, oh, and yeah. we've just got to the airport, and they've got it. And it's so. well cheaper than what it was yeah. in the park, apparently. So we're on the plane. Um, we've been delayed a little bit because it's a storm. Um, but we've just been giving it all clear. Apparently it's going to be a bumpy ride. The weather is atrocious outside. You didn't say so, the correct way. What? It's going to be a bumpy ride. ride. Take it away, you <laughs> Yeah, take it away. It looks awful outside. He did say just, we've got to hang on, so... <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> it's windy. It's windy. Yeah. I'll see if I can capture this on the screen. It's a little bit windy. Let's see if it comes off. You see the wind and the rain just here. See it up there, throw it blowing there. Yeah. There it is, just AK. Yeah, it's really bad. Let's just say it's going to be exciting. That's got a sick bag. Oh, there's lightning. Oh, we've got sick bags out, ready, prepared. I mean, I. It's gonna be, it's gonna be great, it's gonna right? Be, it's gonna be a ride. It's gonna be great. Help. Help. In a minute. Oh, I'm already 
call you. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> We're up now. And it's not that bad, is it? It's actually quite smooth. So far. Because it's still lightning in the area, it's quite smooth, so... We're only... 40 minutes delayed, which isn't too bad. The view's nice anyway. And just like that, guys, we are back. Finally, we've actually been back for a while now. You probably we? don't want to know the day that we're actually filming this. <laughs> Let's just <laughs> say... guess in the comments what dates you think we're filming this. Yeah, it's... Let's see if anyone guesses it. But you know what? So when you come back and, and you've had that long day and you do all your washing and go shopping, there's no rush really, especially for when we vlog, there's no rush to get this last video up, um, the ending of this video, up because, well, we haven't edited any other videos, so there's no rush. But yeah, let's just say it's mid-summer. Don't, don't be giving them clues. They have to guess. Uh, but no, uh, the flight coming back home, I personally don't remember much of it because I slept for the first time ever. Me I too. slept all the way through because it was a dead late flight, wasn't it? It was super late. Yeah, and I think that really helped mm -hmm. because we've been on flights before. Usually the flights back from Orlando are like six six ish Normal. aren't they? Mm -hmm. But this was, what was it, like 10 ish I think it might have been half oh, 10. Was it? Yeah, I think it was due for about 10 ish, half 10, but obviously we went a bit later, I think. But yeah. that really helped because obviously you were super knackered. And obviously we've been up since God knows what, God time. Knows what time in the morning. So we were, I were ready to sleep and I did. And I, mm. I slept the entire way as well. I actually hell, don't, but I don't think I turned my TV on. I don't think I even switched the TV on on the on the plane. No, I don't think I watched. Oh, I know what I did. I listened to music, guys. There was mm. a random Clubland playlist. Can and imagine? I put that on. Going to sleep. <laughs> Scooter. Are you ready? Yeah. No. Actually. And she's like. <laughs> no, actually. Scoo <laughs> Scooter weren't on the playlist. Oh. But I mean, gutted Virgin, you need to put him on your playlist because yeah. that would be a right laugh. Like but, I would be up there. Like, do you know what though? It would have been. It was. I listened to music. I did and fell asleep. It could have been a good fight. <laughs> it would have been because obviously yeah. on the way out it was good. Did you eat any of the food? No. Nope. I don't think I did. Nope. You know, coming home. So God knows what that was. Sorry, guys. Yeah, but do you know what? The flight there was really good, and I'm assuming the flight back was really. It must have been good because for the first time ever, I slept all the way back, and that was amazing. Yeah. I remember waking up and being like. 20 minutes left and I was like oh my god like, I was so yeah. happy so happy and then we obviously we got through security dead quick we got our bags super quick just came back and did all the boring stuff like you know the unpacking washing shopping but the overall trip the best I'm gonna say hands down the best trip we've ever taken isn't it hands down the best Love, trip absolutely loved it what was your highlight oh Give yourself a time to think. Mine was jet skiing with my brother and the dolphins, which you would have seen came up right next to us. That was surreal. That was surreal. The best oh, thing, the yeah. best thing ever. So that was probably the highlight of my. Oh. My, oh. And the 300 foot drop. Finally, somebody no, did it with me. Absolutely Finally. Not. <laughs> next time, Lisa's doing it. Absolutely with me. not. <laughs> what was yours? Um, the airboat ride. Oh, the airboat ride. Yeah. That was one of my favourite things I've ever done. That like, was amazing. Not just in Florida, but like in general in my life. Mm -hmm. Like I generally think that was the best thing. Yeah. Like it was just, I didn't know what to expect to be honest. And it was just absolutely amazing. Like I would 10 out of 10 recommend mm -hmm. that. If you go in, do that. We said this absolutely though, didn't we? amazing. Every single person on the boat, even people that weren't with us were saying all the way through, we were just like. Yeah. All the way through, it was next level it was so good and you're guaranteed to see a lot of wildlife mm -hmm. like we saw one like straight away like we remember? saw a gate obviously they had like the pig and the cat and like the mm -hmm. bird and the gate was there but actually on the um i don't know what you call it it's not really a river is it 
I think what so. What do they call Stream, it? Stream, maybe? Stream's a little thing. Do, we'll go with river. Swamp. But, sw swamp, yeah. Swamp. As soon as we got out in the swamp, there were loads. So you're guaranteed as well, I think, to see gators as well. And it was re a really good price. And not that, that's what I was going to say then. For that experience. I mean, I feel like there might be more, there might be different ones nearer, mm -hmm. maybe, Orlando. Like, you know, the town centre, like, where Disney is and stuff. But, because so obviously it was a bit of a way out, wasn't it? That yeah. the one that we went to. But it was because we went on the way to NASA, but yeah, any airport ride I presume mm -hmm. we go, but that one, I mean, it's I reckon it's worth the road trip 100%. there. It's the one at Midway it's called, it, but. It was just, it was amazing and it was so cheap. Insane. And it was so cheap. So to have that level of experience for that price. That was one of my favorite things. One of the best things. And I also really liked hiring that pontoon boat. Oh yeah. With Vivian and Karen. Yeah. Like on our last day, like that was really good. Like we're we gonna do it again next trip, definitely. Yeah. We've already said I wanna do it again. Yeah, like, definitely. I don't know about the airboat, depending on if we like hire a car or mm -hmm. whatever we do next shit, but definitely hire that pontoon boat. Yeah. Really good. If you've got a big group here, so cheap. Yeah, not only is it, is it just, it's a, an experience in itself, it's so cheap. It was like $8 a piece, so. And it's so chill. Yeah, like, it's relaxing, in it? You're in Disney, but you're like the most chillest person mm -hmm. ever. Like, you're out of the crowd, you're on your own boat, music blaring, play a bit of scooter if yeah. you want, guys. You know, amazing. <laughs> <laughs> and then me like one in Moana and she's we like we didn't play scooter <laughs> they had like happy rafter on Moana yeah, um, Disney stuff Disney songs which obviously come on we had to do that but next time scooter scooter I'm going to be in charge of them tunes next time um, pop century amazing oh my god the hotel amazing. absolutely amazing I'd love to stay there again yep. that skyline of being there amazing 10 out of 10 yeah that, that that is a highlight. Yeah, I mean, that the room... Is really good. The room itself, with them all being uh, renovated, they're all very similar, so the room itself is fantastic. Yeah. You probably would have seen in some of the vlogs when we were back, we had a stupid drawer that just kept coming out. So apart from that, we had faulty it drawers. It was like a haunted mansion drawer. Like, yeah. in the queue where them books come out, it was like that. <laughs> so, <laughs> like, aside from that faulty thing, the rooms itself were very I similar mean, to... I was just going to say, the rooms were very similar to where we stayed, mm. at all, when we all stayed stuff. at All Star Music. The rooms are very similar. Yeah. Um, it was basically just a skyline, really, yeah. at the different location, but but definitely stay there again. Oh, God, yeah, absolutely, 100%. Really, really good, 100%. yeah. Uh, but we do have another plan, uh, trip planned. That is that is a fact, uh, but obviously it's we not until... We <laughs> Yeah, it's not until the end of the year, unfortunately for us. Uh, so we just got to wait a little bit. Lucy might have a mini trip in between, but... I don't think I'll vlog that anyway. No, you're going to be in your you're own, You're not going to be there, are you? So, no. um, Sorry, guys, star of the show. I mean, he is a star of this show, so, I mean, <laughs> no one would watch if it was just me vlogging. <laughs> so, <laughs> we ain't doing that. Uh, but yeah, we were literally back for what was it maybe like a day and then we thought you know what let's get some yeah. booked in because yeah, you guys know without a countdown life's just really rubbish yeah that's true facts isn't it? like i was depressed facts I, was, right there. I was just like at least just having a countdown you just get more like it's just so exciting and so, you know us we can't we help it we can't yeah help and it yeah yeah so mm. <laughs> with that being said we are going to end this vlog series here unfortunately it has come to an end until next time so Thank you guys for watching. Yeah. Please do like, subscribe, comment, ask us whatever you want. Our inboxes are always open on Instagram. Oh yeah, um, definitely. We love so, speaking to you guys. Yeah, ask us anything you want, any tips, tricks, whatever. Just just send them over. And uh, yeah. I'm not a busy man, so, you know, I'll reply. We'll always reply. The next video after this will be the haul. We'll yeah. show you everything that we've got again. So we've got quite a lot. I think it's going to be quite a longer haul That's compared it. to last trip. Yeah. Because I think we just, I don't think we filmed a haul. On one of the trips, we just mm. like did an overview, but yeah, yeah, yeah. this time we have got, we'll do a sit down video. We've got quite a lot to show you guys. So that'll be the next week's video. Yeah. So with that being said, we are off. Thank you guys for watching. Again, please do like, subscribe. Yeah, if you do, have, all, do all the bits. If you have enjoyed this vlog it. series, have a wonderful evening and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye. Boom, boom, ba -doom, boom, boom, boom.